Right, everyone, this is an amended invite. Um, due to the La Perouse Land Council, who decided that uh, any of the mob who wants to camp over at the Land Council grounds is going to get charged with trespass and removed, and they have no authority. This is someone who doesn't even come from this country here, and he's telling, telling everybody what's going to happen on their land. No problems, we worked around you. We've now got uh, permission from Waverley Council to set up down here at Bondi Beach, tents and all the rest of it. Um, and we'll be, uh, we'll be here for the two days, we won't be going to La Perouse. So if anybody who's seen the original invite, there's been a change of plans at the last minute. And we invite you all down here to Bondi Beach as of about 10 o'clock tomorrow morning, Saturday the 22nd of May. Very good morning from myself, Gary Jagamara. Um, once again, we do apologise for change in such a short amount of time. This weekend is about you, about the older people, the next generation, and also the old coming back together again and to settle our disputes, then treaty, to make sure anyone who speaks on behalf of ourselves and country is punishable and signs up a waiver to be punishable by tribal law. If you're not of country, you cannot speak on behalf of country unless you have the right by the people of the country. Exactly and right. if you speak on behalf, you are liable by tribal law. You must sign a waiver or you have no right to speak on behalf of country. Clearly to all of the original people of this continent, that the land councils are there to speak the state's interest, not to represent the people, not to facilitate a gathering of the people, not to facilitate any uh, retention of our culture or law. They're there to protect the state. They're there to do the state's bidding. Okay, well, so be it. We don't need the state land council, we don't need the local land councils or the regional land councils. If we're going to do this and we have the support of the elders, the true people, the people of country. Again, the invite goes out, come and join us. Learn what it's really all about. I'd like to give a good shout out to Waverley yes, Police thanks. Station, yeah. Waverley Police and Waverley Council for their ongoing support with this walk towards a new beginning for us all. We'd also like to acknowledge the, the, the original and current owners of this country, the Dudigal people. We appreciate the, uh, the elders that have made it clear to us that we're welcome on their country to do this. We have undertaken to do this at the request of elders from all over the country, all over this continent, and that's what we're doing. We're, we're going to be doing this so that we can bring the elders together so that the truth can be told. And respond to Mr Rudd's recent creation of the uh, National Congress or the private company called the National Congress that he believes somehow is going to speak for us. After this weekend, there'll be no doubts, Mr Rudd. You don't tell us who speaks for us. We tell you who speaks for us. Blessings. The best begins from now, and right. we'll see you through the weekend. Have a good Please, time. Please, Bondi Beach. And remember, this is a peaceful thing. Anybody that turns up and wants to get violent or anything like the police will handle you because uh, we've informed the police, we're, we're, we're working with the police, and we, we have no intention, no one who's attending this, none of our elders or our families have any intention to either to uh, either instigate or tolerate violence. There'll be no violence, there'll be no intimidation, no thuggery, so all of those of you know who you are, do yourself a favour and stay away. You're not welcome. Those of you who want to see come and, and discuss the truth and uh, be part of the solution in the truth here, welcome. Blessings.